Uh, about 1.2 million uh, farmers depend on cassava for, for food and also sources of income to that. The virus diseases we are talking about here, we have cassava mosaic disease and the cassava brown streak disease. These diseases has tremendously caused the huge uh, cassava uh, yield loss. Zora mhogo ni mpenzi wa kulima lakini sasa mihogo ime inatusumbua namna ya ugonjwa. Matatizo hapa kwa sababu matatizo na yanakuja kwa sababu mategemeo ya mihogo ambayo tunayo lima ili kusudi uvune uuze kwa sababu wakati tunauza ukivuna unauza huku unakula. Sasa namna ya kuuza inafika sehemu inashindika na kwa sababu sinaoza na maana ndio sasa hivi tunatapata tapa tuna na watoto na maana ndio maana tunakimbia kwenye mpunga sasa ili kusudi una tusaidia lakini mihogo imetutupa asante matatizo ya mihogo unapolima mihogo inaoza yani kama sasa hivi ukiangalia ukija kuanza kuingoa mihogo yote chini imeoza kwa hiyo tufanye tufanye nini ili kuepusha magonjwa maana nikiukuta umeoza nina nina na yatupa tu hayo yaliyooza cassava brown street and cassava mosaic disease are viral diseases which affect cassava both these diseases can cause a loss of to 100 no percent a farmer can get nothing because of the infestation of the of cassava brown street and cassava mosaic disease so the quality of the root is, is not there, so farmer cannot say, sell this one. Yeah. Asala, I, ni mewai kwa ipata. Mm -hmm. Kwenye mihogo yetu ya kienyeji. Mm. Asala, mihogo yote ilioza. Mm. Eh, ilioza, kwa sababu ilikuwa na michilizi, michilizi yote ilikuwa na uozo uozo tu mihogo. Mm. Kwa hiyo nilikuwa na asala. Mm. Sikuvuna, sikupata chochote. Yaani tatizo hili limeanza kwa miaka, kwenye miaka ya tisini na kitu. Ndiyo maana hata kil, kilimo cha mihogo wengi wakakimbia. Hilo, hii wanaita ni, ni kutoka, kutoka gangweli wanaita gangweli. Sengerema huko. Eh, sengerema. Hii ni, ni ugonjwa tayari. Mihogo hii ina ugonjwa tayari imeathirika hata mhogo wako ukitaka kutoa umeoza ugonjwa ni ugonjwa ugonjwa huu diseases this is the diseases yeah the, this is the typical symptoms of the cassava mosaic disease if the plants are affected by this disease, then there is no yield or you get very little. If the infection is from early stages, then don't, you don't get anything. If we, it comes later by, say, white flies, then that's where you got uh, reduced production. And so this plant is, is very young and it's showing pretty severe symptoms. Exactly. And now this is, uh, shows that the planting material, the cutting which was used, it was also infected. So mm. the selection of the materials was not good yeah. because the infection was from the start. So when the farmers do not understand the, 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 the disease well, and they go to other farm neighboring fields picking the materials. <coughs> they take even the infected ones because of not knowing, because of lack of knowledge. So they just pick without knowing it's a disease. They go and they plant and the disease continues spreading. <laughs>